Southwest China's Chengdu City will host the World University Games this Friday onwards. Thousands of young athletes will be competing, unleashing their best performances in the next one week and a half. But how much do you know about the city? What are some special features of this sports event? Beat Beat, the insight you need, I'm Wang Tianyu. The University Games is a great example of China's green and low-carbon development. Chengdu is the capital city of Sichuan province. It is located relatively south in China and lies in a big basin. That's why the weather here is hot and humid in the summer. But cooling buildings down may now need air conditioners. In the university village, the hourglass-shaped alleys inside the buildings are called Hu alleys. The special design serves to increase airflow and bring down temperature. It is hard to explain the physics. Basically, when air goes through narrow places, it will move faster. The cool air comes from the wider side and then pushes the heat away. The most important thing is, this kind of alley covers an area of 1,400 square meters in the sports event. Compared with ACs, the cool alleys can save 70,000 kilowatt hours a year. That equals to the total energy usage of 20 families in a year. Low carbon technologies are also used in transportation. The shuttle I'm taking is a limited edition for the games. Just like thousands of buses running in the city, this shuttle is a new energy vehicle. During the University Aid, around 2,400 new energy vehicles will be used for transportation services. And all of the shuttle buses in the village use clean energy. There's a lot more about how the University game saves energy. For example, the rainwater collecting system in the water polo venue can provide all the water needed for surrounding plants. The phones provided for delegations to borrow are refurbished second-hand phones with biodegradable materials. These are all part of China's efforts to peak its carbon dioxide emissions by 2030 and achieve carbon neutrality by 2060.